Here's another quick video. I uh, just got him off of eBay. Paid 10 bucks. It was about seven or eight bucks and then like two or three bucks shipping. And looks like somebody tried to flip this figure. So here's the baggie he came in for 12. I think he made the auction think he was gonna double his money, but he didn't, he lost money. And I got him, but I already had him. This is mine from childhood. And if you saw the earlier video where he appeared in, uh, I lost him for about about 17 or 18 years. He was in a crack in my wall. That's why he looks so mint. Uh, I didn't find him again until I was in my early 20s. Why do I have to have another one? Because he's a variant. Look. The pocket superheroes. This was a little bit earlier in the run. This was later in the run. That's why I have him. Because I was of age to get him. This probably came out in, what when I was like just born or one years old or so but you can see the changes uh, I did an earlier video on uh, Bego Pocket Hero comic action variants and I didn't have the spider-man but look at this they changed them up made them a little bit more accurate they gave him a paint app on here and I guess it's easier to not mold two pieces of two colored pieces of plastic it together because that's not paint that is molded plastic on top of another piece of plastic I mean, this one overall looks better. If they were going to do that, why can't they, like, fill in his armpits? But, uh, I'm quite happy with this figure. Another check off, uh, another item to check off my, uh, Pocket Heroes collection. I still got, I don't know, the Jarrell, Zod, Luthor, uh, Straight-legged, 